Hello everyone. Welcome back to Tekton.com. And yes, I'm back again to help you with your gate preparation for 2018. In this video, we will be talking or we will be discussing the syllabus of Virtual Gate 2018. But before that, uh, let me uh, do an announcement. Uh, this year is going to be the last year for Virtual Gate. From 2018, uh, I mean 2019, year 2019, we won't be supporting because of the various constraints, because of the uh, lack of time. Uh, but as this is last year, this is going to be the best ever. Although you uh, during these years, these many years of uh, starting from 2014, Virtual Gate has been the best test series available. There is no doubt, and many of the toppers has been produced by this examination so this year we will try to make it best best among all these years and yes as this is last so it has to be best yes now uh, let's talk about the syllabus we have prepared uh, earlier we published a syllabus but uh, this would be a bit modification so you can see we have few days left in august and then we have four months left so if you're watching this video later than 18th then you will have to you know push yourself and cover the previous topics so what i suggest you follow the topics according to the dates mentioned here and we are giving priority to maths because we believe that it is one of the most scoring subject in gate and also you know it's easy to get marks in these subjects okay so starting with mathematics we will be having our first test on second it will be the test will be opened on second and you can see once this mathematics is over we have kept one day for revision so when you are preparing you keep marking when the subject is done and once this uh, when the topic is done and once the entire subject is covered by you you mark it here okay so the idea is that at the end of this uh, december 31st all the subjects here are marked all the check boxes are on okay so we have also given uh, the days according to the you know uh, amount of content in the subject in the topic so for example database design we have given two days but year model we have given only one day okay so that's how we have distributed it so that uh, you get it you know uh, you get maximum utilization out of it and we have also marked which are the weekends so for example two three are weekends then nine 10 hour weekends and we have tried that during each test one weekend falls so that uh, if you are engaged engaged with other curriculum you can manage your time to appear into the test right and this is syllabus only up to december after december we will come up with another mixed syllabus so what we want is that all the learning part is over by december we want to keep january only for revision okay so in January, for the purpose of revision and to give you the real heat of exam, we will come up with mixed tests. So initially, we will come up with small mixed tests, so which will be of from two, three subjects and 30, 40 questions. And then we will have our full length virtual gate as always. OK, so this is the entire syllabus and this is the distribution. So if you are already following something, that's good. But if you are not, I su suggest that, you know, you follow this this entire curriculum and this is will going i mean this is going to drastically change your uh, gate rank or marks okay uh, and aligned with this entire schedule what we have done is we have also prepared this preparation sprint on tectured so i think you must have already registered for it it's not yet live for you so this is uh, development going on and pritish is working late to finish the development Pritish is one of our detected users. He used to prepare for gate. Now he is working with us. Uh, he is working full time with us. He works on another project, but uh, as detected is, you know, he has uh, used detected, so he likes to contribute his effort on detected. Yeah. So this is the dashboard, and uh, uh, here you have all the status of your subjects, your last few days preparation, and this is subject wise status. Once you go to a particular subject, let's say maths. So this is how the topics are displayed chapters okay and so once you are in a particular chapter you have various materials available and at the end you mark your status as completed okay so then this chapter is recorded as 
completed. Okay. And uh, to mention, yes, uh, we have utilized the resources available over internet. We have also used free resources from various popular teachers. Okay, so the, the only idea is to make resources available to you as well as in planned manner. Okay, we just don't want to sell ourselves. Okay, so the whole idea is that you learn and you crack this exam. So this is the entire schedule and I believe if you follow this, this would be uh, really helpful in your gate examination and make sure that you are uh, marking that uh, your chapters are completed and for each test you are making a, a target for yourself for example for test one target that you will get at least 60 percent then gradually increasing test two uh, test two mm -hmm. also after each test you sit and evaluate that what was the point where you did the mistake uh, whether it was uh, due to your due to your lack of knowledge or whether it was due to impatience during the examination so in this manner you learn from your mistakes and you improve yourself gradually okay so even if you start from 40 percent or 50 percent from the first test and you keep increasing then ultimately you will reach till you know 90 to 100 percent yes so this steady improvement is very important so well then uh, good enough for this video uh, we will talk again in the next video and meanwhile what I'll do is I'll create a PDF copy for of this document and I'll share in the virtual gate group on the Facebook. Okay, so you can get a printout and paste it in front of your desk. So wish you all the best and wish you all get success in the gate examination. Thank you.